Greetings and salutations. My name is Tish and welcome to the Artist Haven, where home plus art equals heart. In tonight's live video broadcast, we are going to do our Saturday night shenanigans. Root, 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 root. Yeah. <laughs> That's as close to singing as you're ever going to get me to. If you're new to our channel, welcome. If you're in, if you enjoy this broadcast, broadcast, please click that subscribe button right down there in this little corner, down right somewhere in this general vicinity, and that'll let you know uh, when we go live again and when we upload new content. So, <laughs> how's everyone doing today? Woo! I'm so glad it's Saturday because I only have one more day of work left. Da -da -da. Da, 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 da. And it's almost Christmas time for those of you who celebrate Christmas. And I do believe it's Hanukkah right now. So I can't remember exactly how that lies. I don't remember. Anyway, what angels do we have with us tonight? It's Elisa. Ta-da! And Blair. Ta-da! Jason might not be able to join us tonight. I don't know. His internet has been kind of sketchy all day. <clears throat> I guess they had a power outage last night that lasted for at least two hours. So Canadian internet is broken. Because <laughs> that's, yeah, that's kind of how that works. <laughs> so <laughs> what's the devil for? Ooh, Elisa. <laughs> Oh boy. Yeah, no, no. <laughs> There's a, yeah. PG 13 Tish, PG 13. Okay. Hello again, Mama. Yes. Blair, my darling dear, I love you. Thank you so much for all that you do. And <laughs> I'm not an angel. <laughs> I didn't say you were weren't a devil because you know what holds up a angel's halo their horns De -de -de. <laughs> so oh i'm having to have a drink of my juice here hang on a second i say so a lot though i do i realize this now the more lives i do the more i try and not say it but it's like almost not it's almost like telling me not to breathe Well, it's either your halo or it's either your horns or your tail. Because, you know, sometimes it gets slightly askew and you just take your tail and flip it back up again. See, and, you know, depends on how talented you are. Okay. So, here we go again with the soul. <laughs> bad, just bad. Um, let's, first off, let me turn off, whoa, turn off my notifications so my phone doesn't blow up. Well, it'll still blow up, but just you won't hear it because that gets to be annoying. And I do apologize. I think I figured out, excuse me, why my autofocus wasn't working last night is because I didn't have enough light because I've been playing around with it. Um, I've been playing around with it for um, about 10 minutes, just trying to figure out why. And so I moved my lights around. And so I don't know how the final project um is gonna look as far as giving you guys a close-up um i suppose i could take my camera down and do it that way i just if i have my webcam clamped like literally clamped with one of these well it's black but it's just like this clamped to a piece of wood so because <laughs> i'm high tech over here <laughs> anyway so we're going to do a big cup tonight, and we're going to do a dirty cup. So we need to have some colors, some colors, some colors, because letters. Yeah, the pa I, um, I should probably, I should have probably peeled this off, but, because this is actually kind of cool. But I wasn't sure, hey, it's actually going to come up. Hang on one second. Let me, okay, you come up. Wait, wait. Mm -mm -mm. Wish all the skins came up this easy. 
Now watch, I'm gonna hit a bunch of snags. Nope. It's got some really cool, I like this, this side better. It's got this cool texture and the colors are kind of snazzy. I'm trying to get it to come off in one piece, kind of. There we go. Oh, see, that was still wet. So, that's okay. But yeah, that's kind of cool, except for where I got paint. Hang on, I have a rig. I'm just going to buff that part out. There we go. Yeah, because it's, I don't know what the deal is. I think it's just because, you'd think it was because the, there's no humidity in here that everything would dry really quick, but no, not so much. But that's pretty cool. Let me see. Oh, yeah. That's, see, uh, but the light, I have the light kind of shining across the, instead of down. So maybe it won't be too bad. Hello, Tina. Ta da. Hello, Cynthia. Ta da. I'm just showing off my skin that I peeled up. <clears throat> okay. The skin, the acrylic skin, not my own skin. That would be kind of gross. Okay, we're going to put this on the back of my chair just because I don't have my other piece of plastic to put on my skin pile. Okay, so Saturday Night Shenanigans is all about you guys and gals and ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages. Did I use all that white up from last night? I didn't think I did, but I guess I did. So, <clears throat> well, we're not going to have a base coat. That's why we're going to do a bigger cup. And we might have to do a base coat. Maybe we'll do, hmm. Hmm. Well, let's get some more white going. While you guys didn't. I need five colors. Please, one color a piece. And don't give me like 20 different. And they, I don't care if they go together or not. No, I just, you know, just give me colors. Just give me colors. And I'll do my best to um, satisfy those. Let's see. We probably can do, let's see where we're at here. Hang on. Give it a swirl. Okay, and let's do five ounces of Floetrol. No, let's do six because that's easier because then I just do three ounces of paint. My brain doesn't have to hurt because Math and I are not friends. Oh, you know what? There's my, I forgot to do something. Here, let's do this first. Eggplant. I don't think I have an eggplant. You got last night's notification at 1130-ish. Well, that is just not acceptable. You know, I kind of had that problem today. I was going to watch Travis's live and I got busy at work and the notification for that didn't come through until like two o'clock so yeah i don't know i think it's part youtube part my phone so let's see we need three ounces there we go kind of bummed i just broke that but it's okay okay we gotta tip this butt upside down so it all falls to one end okay let's get this out of the way before we spill on it as, as if it needs any more help being spilled on. Eggplant. I don't even know how to make an eggplant. Blue. <laughs> She's filling in for Jason tonight. <laughs> I think art community needs to call it something else. Pulling sin skins just sounds wrong. I know, I know, I know. 
my mind goes to a variety of different things and it none of them are good well not really okay so we have blue red purple make an eggplant <laughs> I cooled my own skins this summer after a very bad burn. Well, yeah, gross. <laughs> I, you know, I feel for you. I feel for you. <laughs> so many different sunscreens and they're all left in the car. That's why you put it on before you leave. I used to put sunscreen on before I even left the house. Oh, there's a chunk right there. Hang on. we got to rectify that situation. That's a disaster waiting to happen. Okay. This is going to be interesting painting these. <clears throat> I won't say what mine. Yeah, no. PG-13. That's what the <laughs> We're not intended for children at all. And, and I mean children as in under 18, 18, you know. 17 or younger, but <clears throat> I keep it PG-13 because I don't want to offend anybody. Um, I do not have I do not have words blocked because I want freedom of speech. So if you guys are free to say whatever you want, but you know I don't personally want to offend anybody. If you don't want to do eggplant, then my choice is neon yellow. Okay. I'll do yellow because eggplant, I, I don't have any purple mixed up at all. And purple, I, I would do like a, I would almost do purple and brown and a little bit of, and a little bit of red. Down here too. Yep. We are sunscreen hourly. Yeah. Well, you had to put sunscreen on even in the winter time here in Minnesota because the sun is reflected off the snow. And if you plan on going out hiking or anything out in the cold, sunscreen, you know, especially on a sunny day or snowmobiling. I've known people who get some birds snowmobiling. So there we go. Okay. So blue, what color, what shade of blue do we want? I've got cobalt blue. I've got a, well, there's a little bit of dark blue left. This is the Persian blue. This is phthalo blue, um, and then red. I already know which red I'm gonna grab because I know I know which one I want. If I can find it, <laughs> that's the whole kit. This quinacridone red. I love this red, and this is the best, truest red I've got. Unless we want to do a metallic red. Eggplant sounds so pretty. Yeah, skiers tan. Yep, they look like a raccoon. Cobalt, cobalt blue, cobalt blue and red. And then neon yellow for Miss Elisa. Closest I have to neon yellow is this lemon yellow or the artist loft yellow, which is. I don't know. I like this one better. What? Oh, man. Ow. Uh, it says why I have a problem going to the beach. I don't like taking my socks off and my shoes off. I mean, I don't mind wearing, I don't mind, like, I don't wear sandals or flip flops because I, 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 I twisted my ankle too many times and I end up twisting my ankle in sandals. Because they, they get slippery if it rains, or if my feet sweat too much, or if I spill something on my shoe. So I got to wear something that gives me a little bit more stability. <clears throat> so I used to wear flip-flops all the time, but I just can't anymore. I'm afraid I'm going to hurt myself really bad. I'm getting old. It's Mr. Desert Man. Hello, Chris. Ta-da. It's Chris. Walking in the sand is great for your calves. It's also great for exfoliation. But I just, I don't know. I haven't done it in a long time. Okay, so we got cobalt blue. 
Did we ever decide are we gonna do metallic red or are we doing the quinacridone red? And then Chris needs to pick a color too. Persian. Okay, who <laughs> Tina's pick, okay. You guys are confusing me. I have been up since 2.30 this morning. That's why I'm covered in paint again. I did take a shower, but then I decided to clean stuff and move stuff around. And I put my arm underneath the painting we did last night to kind of lift it up and put it on the tray and the drying rack. And I got paint all over my arm. I went to work like this. I'm like, I don't care. I'm an artist. They expect my wacky stuff. <clears throat> Driving, so I'm listening, but won't be able to type much. Gotcha. Thumbs up, dude. Regular red? Okay. So we got cobalt blue, regular red. Let's do the lemon yellow. Because I, I don't know. I like that yellow. I actually, and for me to like a yellow, that's kind of odd. Guys, okay. So what else did we have, guys? I don't remember. Burr, burr, burr. I'm scrolling back. I'm scrolling back. Uh, uh, uh. Elisa and her eggplant. Tina said blue. Regular red. Cynthia said purple. Okay, purple. Shoot. think yep I do have a little bit of purple left in this bottle just like this much though so it's not gonna be much but if we put it if we put the purple and then blue and then red and then yellow okay you guys <laughs> eggplant she says ah dude I haven't mixed up my purple yet. <laughs> That's all the purple I got. Why you gotta be so difficult? E this. I need to go. I need Michaels to put their paint on sale. <laughs> no, we're gonna stick with the canvas that I have picked up because I don't wanna. <sighs> Chris, shout out a color quick. <laughs> turquoise I can do okay how about okay so I've got this metallic cobalt blue but it's kind of a turquoisey color when it dries if you can see that you and your glare Chris says gold. <laughs> oh, bother you guys. In my mind, he did it. Well, yeah, he's always using that 24 karat gold. I didn't get to see your video from this morning, Chris, because people were being annoying today at work. Well, not annoying. They wanted me to be social. I'm like, I don't want to be social. I want to watch this video. <laughs> so let's grab the 24 karat gold. <laughs> oh, well, well, oh, there he is. Okay, so we'll do these. We have two metallics. Well, we have six colors now, but that's okay because we're going to go. We're that way. We just kind of go with it. Okay, so let's go like uh, this. We're going to do. Okay, can you still see that? Oh, yeah, that's right, because I got the camera up higher because this has got a little bit better resolution than my cell phone as far as it's, it doesn't do the zoom thing. I don't know how to get out of that in the other. Okay, so I'm saying that so again. Damn it. Well, for what we're going to do, we're going to do the gold first. And go one, two, three, 
do some white, one, two, three, do some white. Actually, let's do it this way. That'll look cool. I'll be okay with that. Okay. So let's give this a gentle stir. Stir, not fold. Stir, stir, stir. Too many years of whipping stuff. Food stuff, people. Food stuff. Okay. <laughs> oh, you'll get your pink. <laughs> we already picked gold for you, Chris. And they'll be pink because of the red. I'm sure we'll get some pink. Okay. So I'm going to do my best to layer these a little bit so I can get all the colors in here twice because we're going to do something kind of interesting, at least interesting to me. Oh, let's move this out of the way. There we go. Oh, my goodness. This is getting goopy. I need to go get some more of that gold. Dang it, tomorrow's Sunday, so Hobby Lobby's closed. It's like, I only have Sunday and Monday to go running around, people. Why do you got clothes? I understand. They're a Christian company, and I respect that. So. Ooh. Okay, you know what we're going to do? I got an idea. Hang on. Bear with me, people. We're going to do his pink. But because he's always doing the, the, um, oh, what's it called? The deco art colors, the extreme sheen colors. We're going to do the extreme sheen. Wait, one, two, three, white. Ha, 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 I caught myself. Oh, this is going to have to be like this. Actually, let's go like this. old bartender trick and yes I am an old bartender I'm old I'm a bartender it's been a while though okay <clears throat> oh am I off camera there we go oh there went the auto focus though Yellow. Okay. And then yellow. And then we'll do this pink. I'm starting to remember roll roll them because here's what you do <laughs> with a blue moon beer you roll it before you open it don't shake it because then you'll be wearing your beer instead of drinking your beer and that's no bueno but i figured rolling it doesn't shake up beer so it would but it stirs it so it should work for the paint, right? That's my theory. Okay. Let's do a little bit more white here. Okay. And then we're going to do the red. Come on. I'm mixing up more of this red. 
on Monday. So come on, Lid, work with me. I'm gonna put that back over there. And I think I got a little bit of gold left in here. I don't know what that was, but something just fell. Probably something that I needed for this, but hey, I don't think so, but. <laughs> well, it's kind of chaos in here right now at the moment because I come in like a whirlwind when I come home from work. I'm going to dump some purple on top. Get this goobery thing out of my way. Okay. Drizzle some white. Here's me trying to put the lid on in the... Hello, Karen! Ta-da! Karen is here! <laughs> yep, that should be my middle name, Wrecking Ball. I'm going to do some yellow on top. Well, see, that's why I didn't want to do that, because I have paint all over my fingers already. But I got to find a way to wipe this off. Oh, that's okay. And then some of this pink, I'm going to kind of put it right in the middle of all of that happiness. Okay. That is it. But I did get two layers of the colors, because what we are going to do tonight... I'm going to keep my white handy, but out of the way. Let's grab this out of the way. I need my rag. <clears throat> so, where's that damn saw yet? Jeez, old Pete. Okay, white. Oh, i got to move my phone so I don't get pink on my phone. That would be no bueno. Okay. Oh, I forgot to put my push pins in my canvas here, so give me a moment. And I don't want to put the canvas on there because there's wet paint on there because my apartment is being really weird. It's like 75 degrees in here and like 10% humidity. You'd think things would dry really fast. But no. Look, my no gloves. Yep. Oh, thanks. Shocker. Jeez. Hands were dirty anyways. I, actually, they were clean before I started messing in paint. I wash my hands probably a hundred times at work. Well, not so much now, because get this. They have to monitor when we go to the bathroom or when we go to get a soda or when. So now we have to sign in and sign out to go to the bathroom or to go to leave our station, basically. It's like, are you kidding me? I am not 12. Okay, so we've got a canvas. This is, okay, this is. Yeah, I know. I'm not even going to talk about it right now. I think this board is crooked. Okay, whatever. It'll work. Um, canvas is crooked. <laughs> there we go. Well, it's crooked for <laughs> you guys. It's, it was straight for me. But I wanted to have make sure that I got it all in there. Okay. I, well, they just started doing this, and I'm like, yeah, no. Okay, so we got a canvas, but because it's the holiday season, 
I thought it'd be kind of cool to see what happened if we pour over a Christmas ornament. This is just a clear plastic Christmas ornament. I don't know how it's going to work. I don't know what's going to happen. But I got trying to find the smallest piece of wood, and I put like three, three screws in it. So no matter if I bumped it or whatever happened, it would be good. And oh, well, that's right. I was going to move this over just a little bit so I have a place to put said Christmas ornament when it's done. So we're going to put it this way so I can grab it right here. So we're just going to do it a dirty cup pour right over the top and let the rest of the paint flow out. And then when we're all done, we'll let it sit for a little bit. I'll lift this little piece, see what happens. I don't know. That's the smallest piece of wood I could find that would actually hold the globe. That little bit. And I almost took a drink of paint. Isn't that wonderful? <laughs> oh, boy. Well, I understand people. It's like, okay, I'm a human being, not a robot. I need to have bodily functions. I need to have, and it, it, the thing is, is it's really, it's a clean area, but it's still really dusty. There's a lot of fumes. So I drink a lot of beverages while I'm there. So, all right. Here we go. Let's see how this goes. Well, the turquoise is taking over. Oh, spoke too soon. Here come some other colors. comes that cold. I'm a little wobbly because my feet hurt and I'm standing here. Should have pulled my chair up. We'll just go with the wobbles. Make the walls work for us. Whoop. Perfect dismount. <laughs> Where's the pink? It's in there. 
it's in there. It's like Ragu. It's in there. Or is that Prego? <laughs> oh, that's probably a good thing I didn't sit down on that chair. It has that skin on there. Hang on a second. We're going to move this over here where it's safe-ish. You guys are like, what is she doing? I gotta clean my studio because I decided to move a bunch of stuff out here and I haven't bought my other shelf yet. I still gotta talk to Adam and see if he's got one that he was gonna give me. I'm grabbing my cup of paint. If working pharmacy alone at Walgreens, they don't send anyone to watch pharmacy so you can go. It's illegal to have a pharmacy with no one there. Yep, absolutely. If you have an emergency and go to the bathroom, they write you up. What? You know, um, I don't know what state you're in, but state of Minnesota, I think it's every four hours requires you to have, and I think it might be different for medical professionals, and I think that's what could constitute you as because you're in that profession, but um, <clears throat> You have to be allowed a, four, a break every four hours, but if you're sick or something like that, or you got tummy issues like I do, that's ridiculous. That should be like illegal. I know that um, when I worked at Quick Trip, um, we had to actually lock the front door um, and lock out all the um, all the pumps if we had to go to the bathroom because we've worked alone. So yeah, this is the old cup. I think the cups look cool. That's why I let them dry. And then if I can get the skins to peel in one piece, I keep them. But not all the time do they turn out cool. Not all the time do they come out cool, I should say. The cups are cool, but my job has three ways of tracking you with the same info, yet the results are all different and possible to track. <sighs> Wow. I would think so, especially in Florida, you know, or any, you know, a pop highly populated area that you have to have two people because, you know, drugs are worth money. Hello. Okay. So I'm going to put um, Miss Elisa. Look what I have in my hand. So what I'm going to do here is very gingerly and gently try and pick this up without dropping it. Oh, look, it didn't drip. Sweet. But look at that. Can you see that? That looks so cool. There's an air bubble. Hang on. There we go. Hopefully that'll fill in. Because that looks really cool. I'm going to set that over there so it's out of drip range, I'm hoping. Okay. Yeah, I probably should have put a glove on this hand, too. But I will now. I will now because this is going to get messy. This is going to get messy. I uh, will grant it. Then I, you know what? Here's my here's my solution to that. I just won't shop at Walgreens. I'm okay with that. See, this, you know what's funny is down the street, about probably is about two miles from my house. On this side of the block, there's a Walgreens, and on this side, there's a CVS. You know, there's two major streets. One is Bunker, and the other one I can't. It's like some lake road it goes like this. So north to south, east to west, and it's literally caribou, which I love, and then the Walgreens, and then the CVS. So I can go to CVS. I'm okay with that. I personally, I miss the old school, like, um, mom, pa, 
type pharmacies where you go in and they know your name and you don't have to. I mean, I bought Mucinex and they wanted like four forms of ID. I'm like, are you kidding me? <laughs> He's like, well, people make illicit drugs out of this. And I'm like, do I look like I'm on crack? Do I look like I'm on meth? I just want my cold, my cold medicine so I can go home and go to sleep. <laughs> Dang it. Okay. I think we're good here. Get that little glue because I glued. Get this to kiss up there. There we go. I bet you didn't know you'd have a soundtrack to this movie. Do, 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 do. Like I said, that's as close as you'll get me to sing, is to do the little funny noises. Okay. Just want to make sure that it tips off when I want it to. And we're going to torch this because there's a lot of bubbles that we might get popped. Up goes the bubble. Okay, I think I got it. All right, we're good. I'm going to leave it at that, because otherwise I'll stand here all night and do that, because I get all picky about it. I need to say enough. Okay, we're going to set that there. I'm going to set that over there. Wipe off my gloves. Yeah, I would quit, too. Okay, so I need my torch, Johnny Flame. Well, hello, Doris. Ta-da, Doris is here. And my torch is dying, so we're just going to go with it. Fill it up after we're done. Get off the bubbles. Okay. Put that back up on the shelf. Yeah, I think so, too. See, I don't hear it autofocusing. And I can't figure out how to turn it off, the autofocus off. So I just got to deal with it until I can sit down and figure it out. All right. Let's do a little circle-ish type movement. See where all the paint's at, see what we got going on. There is a lot of gold in this. Holy Toledo. Mm 
no, 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 go away. Okay, I think I'm going to turn this a little bit. Okay, so let's go. shift these paints over down to this corner down here get that last corner see how that turns out and tip back up there we go That's not so stark white. So you can see the glare from the light. And the shadow. I'll figure it out. I've got more lights to put up. That's not such a stark white either. All right. Let me get the drippies off. So that was convenient. There was a booger in there and he came off the edge. That's always wonderful when that happens. He just decided that the painting was too much for him and he decided that we are, he was just going to leave well enough alone. Okay. So let's set this down. I need longer gloves. <laughs> oh, bother. Okay, let's set these over here. Try not to get my arm to drip in the painting. <laughs> and I need to grab my torch refill thingy, my bob. 
So I need my step stool because <clears throat> I don't want to drop it in the painting like I've already done once before on tape and I won't tell you how many times I've done it <laughs> otherwise. I think there's some in this little can. No, I can't change it at all. That's the problem. This is like, I don't understand why it's doing this now. Because as long as I'm in here, <laughs> yes, welcome home, Chris. <laughs> Hello, Angelique. Ta-da, Angelique is here. Okay, so, <laughs> shoot. What is going on? Hmm. I think it's, let me try something. Let me see if this helps. No. Okay, how about this? No. I'm sorry, guys. Now it's doing it even when I'm here. Well. <laughs> I... Hello, Lisa. Welcome here. I can't turn my autofocus off. I don't. Well, I'm sure I can. I just haven't figured out how. Because, yeah. The steering yard doesn't have a place to do it. So. I apologize for the autofocus while I feel this. But I need both hands because I am not strong enough to do it with one hand. Okay. Let's put the bottom on, on this guy. Let's turn this light back the way it was, kind of, maybe. I don't want this to fall. That was the camera on my phone, though, Blair. So it's a different camera. And I can't get my can't my phone to work with... I wonder I keep putting my hand in paint, because there's a paint stick right there. I knew that was a bad idea. All right. No, technology doesn't like me at all, ever. <laughs> Put something very dark next to the painting. This is as dark as I got. It needs to be bigger. That's just going to go right in the muck. Oh. Okay. Well, we're going to just try and give you a close up here. Hopefully, it'll focus. I don't know why it's all of a sudden doing it. It was fine. Well, Fine for most of the life, as far as I could tell. So, I'm going to get, um, I'm going to download the app for this webcam. It's just a Logitech one, and I'm going to see if I turn off the autofocus if it's still. Let's me do it because in stream, this is StreamYard and in Stream Labs, I can actually turn off, I can go into the camera settings and turn off the, um, that looks really cool. I can turn off the, I'm sorry, I'm trying to talk and look at the same time. Um, 
I can turn off the camera settings in Stream Lab, but I can't do it in Stream Yard. So I'm going to download the Logitech app or whatever program, what have you, and see if I can turn off the autofocus and the auto white balance because I think that's where I'm getting. Last time I didn't turn off the autofocus, I turned off the auto white balance. And it was amazing, the difference. Because see right there, it's like balancing the auto, the auto balancing the white. So. Yeah, it, it's very, I, I wish you, you guys could see in person, but this is all the red that you see and all the colors except for that kind of pinkish purple color going on there everything else is metallic in some way shape or form whether it's got the overlay of gold or um it's the pink tourmaline but look at these cells you see them oh <laughs> well did you pour over a christmas ornament like i did <laughs> i'm giving you i'm giving you a little grief chris there's that well i'm hoping it'll dry by tomorrow night might have to put it outside and just let it freeze but um bump Okay, so I just want to get one good picture of that because that is my favorite part and it's not focusing. Let's bring it up closer. Nope. Nope. <laughs> when it's dry dry <laughs> like super dry like dry and then dry it again <laughs> okay so autofocus are, are you guys having issues with the autofocus right now no tomorrow well it'll have about 24 hours to dry because we do sunday night we do the review of last week's of this this last week's projects and um, that's just kind of what we do on Sunday. And then I do another pour or, and I might actually, I'm going to find that other cup as soon as I'm done here with y'all. Um, I love this. I don't know what it is about it, but it's like lost in space, but kind of looks like a bleeding heart. Anyway, um, I'm going to dump that and then maybe we'll just do all the remnant paint from the pores this last week. So. Dry, dry would be dust. <laughs> but I'm watching. I, I don't know if you guys can or can see but if you if you're watching this, there's cells developing, there's clouds developing. It's just yeah, wow, so much coolness going on. This definitely has to go on a gray wall, like almost a dark gray. And let's look at this guy over here. Hang on, I'm gonna move that blue thing. As Lisa was. So being trying to be kind and point out, put something dark up there. Okay, so let's check this guy out. Let's wipe him off first so I don't drip on the painting. I want to see if that bubble filled in. Yep, it filled in. So tomorrow morning, we'll see how dry this is. Let's. I'm going to put him on a napkin here because I don't want to drip. But there is that kind of 
and the gold is shimmery in there and it's layers of pink and salmon <laughs> and blue and purple and white and it turned out quite splendid i must say yes you guys always pick up good, pick out good colors all right and since autofocus is going to be the bane of my existence for the next few days I am going to thank you all for coming tonight. I am ever so grateful. Let me take off my gloves so I don't drip on the painting. That's the point of the gloves, right? Well, it didn't save my arm, Elisa. Elisa, it didn't save my arm. <laughs> but I just wanted to say thank you for joining me. If you like this video, please smash that like button. And if you're new to our channel, welcome again. If you liked what you've seen here tonight, click the subscribe button and the little notification bell and that'll let you know when we go live because we've got 10 more lives to do for sure. Because what we're gonna think we're gonna do is we're gonna do the 30th of December, which is my birthday, ta-da! And um, we're gonna do New Year's Eve. Um, I'll do an early live, and then I'm going to do a ringing in the new year live. Um, and then I'm going to take the first off um, and possibly the second, and then come kicking back at you on the third. So um, I'm going to go have supper with my daughter um, on the first to celebrate my birthday and the new year and everything. So anyway, um, what? <laughs> you guys have the wackiest zany this greatest imaginations i love you guy it's atlas holding the at the ornament on his back <laughs> yay happy birthday to your son angelique Woohoo! all us christmas babies and new year's babies well, your son will have an, I don't know how old your son is, but nobody wanted to go out celebrating on my birthday because mine's the 30th and nobody wanted a two day drunk. So I, I usually celebrated my birthday on, I would go out with a small group of friends for dinner or whatever. And then, um, we'd all celebrate on new year's day. So new or new year's Eve. And, but I'm going to go out to dinner on the first. So that's my, I think that'll be my one night off will be the first of the year. I don't know. We'll see how I feel the day after because <laughs> my daughter's driving. So that means I can have a drink or two. So anywho, thank you again. If you have any questions or comments or anything you'd like to add to our, our live broadcast, please join our Facebook group on Facebook. And you just have to do the at sign. The at sign can't remember the name of it. There's the name of it. It's not ampersand because that's the and sign. Uh, anyway, um, it's just at the artist, uh, the artist Haven. And that will that page will lead, lead you to our group and you're welcome to post on either thing. Um, the group does have a few questions to get in the group. And other than that, um, you're in like Flynn. I appreciate you all. Thank you so much for joining me. Peace, love, and happiness.